With only 24 days to the nation's 2023 general elections, stakeholders are determined to foster smooth and peaceful elections that will usher in credible leaders. It is against this backdrop that NOA, in collaboration with development partners, organized a dialogue with the theme, Nigeria's 2023 elections, fostering youth action for peace, in a bid to synthesize the youth against electoral violence. So yes, there are needs for youth to embrace peace and uh, see how to ensure that the election is free. Stand. So we don't need to engage in violence and uh, we just need to do as much as possible to make sure that uh, the election is uh, peaceful. We, we also know how they have uh, most youth, especially in like local communities, have uh, been engaged in kutogri and electoral violence and all of that. And so this program is really to um, portray the need for youths, you know, to be more educated. The, uh, I've learned that uh, peace is the way forward if we really want to have a... Uh, a credible and a violence-free election. Yeah, that's what I learned. The youth should, as much as possible, uh, remain steadfast, remain vigilant, know that at the end of the day, uh, no one will be a winner when this election is not conducted in the way and manner that we have all been prepared uh, for it. Create awareness, especially to the youths to be able to understand and to know what they are supposed to do. Election is coming. They should not allow themselves to be used by some other people in the wrong way. According to the new release registered voters list by INEC, youths have largest percentage of registered voters. Therefore, stakeholders called on them to stay off violence, but instead channel their energy in exercising the franchise to a throne, a promising administration. Noel Samson, Trust TV News, Abuja.